I remember, back to the days when I didn't have powers. I was just an ordinary guy, but that all changed in a hurry. It was my eighth birthday, and my parents decided to take me on a helicopter ride. I loved helicopters. We got off the ground, and about three seconds later, the darn thing crashed and burned. I was the only survivor. Both of my parents were dead. I was an orphan that nobody wanted. But after a while, I realized there was something special about me. I was just being my normal self, hooping at the park when I took a jump shot, and I just floated there, one centimeter off the ground. I was thinking to myself, what is happening? Then I realized I could fly, but only a centimeter off the ground. Back in the orphanage, I had my best friend mother, Teresa, who I also found out had superpowers. She could heal people, but only if they were dead and could not bring them back to life. I dance all in distressing all day. at only 2 p.m. I don't know. There might be no villain in town. We have to stop him. Let's go to Info Lab B. I am Jim. I am going to take over the world with my powers. Fear me, or I will make the world dark forever. Whoa. <laughs> We need to stop him. The Trump Towers. Wait, why Trump Towers? I just called them to say they had a had him staying there and they said they did room 1046. We got you now. You can't fight what you can't see. <laughs> Smarter than Einstein. Yep. Make sure he's alive so we can lock him away for life. He's still dead. Ow. I do want. I guess.
Wait, no, 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 do, do the evil hands. Do the evil hands. I already know he can, he can fly on his butt. I'm not gonna use that word because I can't use it.